Canada Happy Day. Happy Canada Day, everybody. Happy Canada Day. Oh, <sighs> <that there. laughs> time to get organized. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. Absolutely, we, absolutely. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I saw. I love Anne Murray. I thought that was her name. I thought she was watching. <laughs> I got all excited. Oh. oh my god! Not that I'm not excited that you're all here. <laughs> Let me tell you. Um, yes. Anne Murray, if you're watching, though. Yes, Anne Murray, if you're watching. Please say Hello. something in chat. <laughs> Hello, we love you. Hello, we love you, Anne Murray. <laughs> um, so I hope everyone had a good day today. Craig and I were saying that it was a very, it was a very different Canada Day. Yeah. We are used to having a party and uh, or going to one or something. I'm sure most of you can relate on Canada Day. Yes. So it was uh, quite low key and um, yeah, <laughs> but we're happy you're here. And uh, we're happy to be doing a show tonight. So, uh, you uh, have anything you want to say there, Mister? No, just ha- happy Canada Day. Uh, we uh, we're kind of have a couple of happy coincidences, uh, and this is one of them. Where uh, show night falls on Canada Day, and we decided, you know, let's do it. Uh, I, I know that we you know a lot of people might be out, uh, maybe you know, uh, hanging out with family within their. You know their social bubble, or whatever province or, or area you're in. Yeah. Um. Or you might be having a Canada Day like us, where you're maybe staying home. In which case, you know what? Feel free to hang out with us, and we're going to just celebrate uh, Canadian music and, and what it means to be uh, Canadian. That's oh. right. <laughs> That's right. I love this. Heidi noticed haircut. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> one of my one of my dearest friends, Ashley, gave me a trim. <laughs> Which I so appreciate. That's awesome. Because I hadn't had it touched since December. It was a long time. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Craig still is in need of a little <laughs> trim. Tell, yeah. little trim. Um, I will get it done. Yes. But, yes, you will. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Yes, you will. Some so the song I sang, I just want to show everyone this. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Can y'all see it? This is the Anne Murray record, This Way Is My Way. And... Um, the song Snowbird was on this record. Mm-hmm. And you know who gave me this record? <laughs> Do you know? Uh, Sean. Sean Furlot <laughs> gave me this record. Anyway, I thought I'd feature it. She's wearing some snazzy boots. <laughs> yes. Fun little suit in that in that <laughs> little record jacket there. You would totally wear that outfit like tonight if you could. It, yes, yes, yep. absolutely. Yeah. It's snazzy. Yeah, however, we're, we're not going to be going out shopping anytime soon. <laughs> no, we're not. Not at all. Oh, look, Julia's, uh, she's got her ice cream already. Oh, good, Julia. That's <sighs> wonderful. Perfect. Wonderful, Perfect. wonderful. And Steph, happy Canada Day. Oh, I love you too, Canada Steph. Canada Day. Love you, love you, love you. Yeah, it's very strange to not uh, to not see her on Canada Day. Very yeah. Strange. Oh, my God, Rhonda. Happy Canada Day to you too, Rhonda. I love and miss you. I love your pictures that you post. Happy Canada Day. Now, that is a woman who has dipped her feet into the fountain of youth. <laughs> That's true. Rhonda. Look you, at that photo. <laughs> you look like you're maybe, maybe 40. Yeah. It's I was, incredible. I was going to say late 30s at yeah. the most. but Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and there's Aunt Jean. Hi, Aunt Jean. Happy Canada Day to you, too. Happy Canada Day. Yes. Oh, and the McQueens are watching. Hey, guys. Hey, McQueens. And sorry about your luck, Chris. <laughs> oh, man. I, oh, I can't right. believe it. Yes, I can't Chris believe. broke his arm. Yeah. So sorry to hear that. So I hope you get uh, better soon, my friend, so you yes. can get back to... Doing what you're amazing at, which is uh, playing some uh, some fantastic music. Because I know you guys had plans to do a little bit of a European time zone I show uh, this this weekend, and we, so disappointing. Oh, oh my gosh. Yeah. Well, I hope it heals quickly, and um, then you can mm. get right back to everything you love to do. Because yeah. have you ever broken bones before, Chris? <laughs> I haven't. Just a toe. Well, I've broken I've broken this wrist <laughs> twice. And this wrist once, and my thumb once. So your mom's watching. But, oh, we are here <laughs> celebrating with you, Anne and Craig. Happy, Happy Canada, Canada Day. Day! That's awesome. Oh, Ruth Switzer is here. And Jerain says he's. Oh, he's Ashley is here. Ashley's the one who gave me my haircut, and she did an amazing Isn't job. Isn't it lovely? Isn't she lovely? Mm-hmm. So Chris I says that's the it. first time that he's ever had a had a break. Oh, so. that's awful. Poor you, Chris. Yep. Wow. Well, uh, looks like Drain's having a nice hot chocolate. Uh, what What's everybody out there drinking tonight to celebrate uh, Canada Day? Huh? Yeah. Oh, H- Heidi, I'm wearing your earrings that you gave me. Nice. My red earrings. I, I, I love them. I 
thought I'd I get a little a little weenie festive. <laughs> weenie festive? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I couldn't resist. <laughs> a teeny weenie festive. Yeah, it was just dangling there. I had to I had to grab it. <laughs> oh, oh my. Uh, however, I digress. <clears throat> anyway, yes. so we have some uh, some great uh, selections of Canadian written uh, and or recorded music tonight. Yes, we do. Um, so yeah, we'll uh, we'll try not to keep you guys uh, too long because we know that probably by the time we finish up, for a lot of you folks watching out in the East Coast, it'll be dark and maybe fireworks will be starting uh, if, uh, uh, if they're doing fireworks out in your area. They've so. been setting off fireworks for two weeks here. Getting yes. ready for Canada yeah. Day. Yeah. Anybody with a dog knows that fireworks have been... A poppin'. Yeah. Yeah. They don't wait for Canada Day. Good times. So oh, anyway. Geraint's his birthday in 14 days. That's, That's right. right. That's right, Geraint, because we do share a <laughs> day. share a birthday. Two weeks from today. It's our birthday. <laughs> it's crazy. I've known now, I've, like, I've known a few people with July the 15th birthdays. That's true. For most of my life, I didn't know a soul, and I thought, there you go. And then all of a sudden, we to Ontario, boom. Yeah. Yeah, it's I just, crazy. I just noticed when I'm sh- when I'm sharing comments that have emojis in them, the little Canadian flag doesn't show up. Shows up in mine. No, on your on your on your phone it does, but on our little oh. screen thing. Oh, that's that's too bad. Mwah. That's too um, bad. So, Durant, what do you want for your birthday? Yeah. What do you want? Whatever it is, hope you get it. Me too. Well, Craig, should we get to it? Yes. Uh, what uh, What do you have selected this evening? Well, uh, the next song we're gonna do is a song. Oh, Faith. Faith Hawkins is watching. Hi, Faith. Hey, Faith. Oh, someone else she said happy, happy hi, and I didn't recognize them. Uh, Trish, good. Happy Canada Day yes. to you too, Trish. Happy Trish. Happy Canada Day to Trish. So um, if you're here oh, for the very right. first and time, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank us. you. And next week, Julia's birthday. She said next week, me, me, me. That's right. It's uh, Julia's birthday. Next that's right. Next Wednesday. Very exciting. Yeah. Okay. Well, okay, this... Uh, this next tune we're going to do... Oh, Glenna's watching. Hi, Glenna. Hello. Um, this next tune we're going to do is uh, written by good old Canadian artist, mm-hmm. Katie Lang yep. and Ben Mink. And, uh, love that name. One of, my, one of my most favorite songs. I love singing this song. Mm-hmm. So, uh, hope you like it, everybody. Happy Canada Day to you, Glenna. Oh, and Beth is watching. Hey, Beth. Hey, Beth. Okay. Hello, everyone. And here we go with and our here we go. our second Canadian installment this evening. That's right.
there we go. Love that song. Love that song. Looks like some of you guys out there loved it too. Uh, and I, I love this uh, comment here. The Steph uh, wishes that they were, she was here to sing I harmony, know. but she's singing out in the wilderness. Yay! So uh, yeah, the chipmunks are getting a show out there. Oh, that's awesome. Jerain never heard that song before, which is what awesome. What? He's over in Wales, so we don't know that oh, they necessarily get you know Katie Lang. Back well, you're gonna have to look her up. She's a staple out this yes, way. Yes, she's pretty pretty fantastic. Oh, looks like Linda's got a uh, an enormous compliment. She says uh, sounds better than Katie Lang. Who? Linda, your new best friend. Really? Yeah. Linda, Linda, thank you, you just earned an invite. <laughs> <laughs> you can come on over anytime. <laughs> Maybe it's just you haven't heard that song for a while. Go listen to her version. It's a fantastic song. <laughs> thank you, Linda. You do sing it beautifully. Thank you. Uh, Constance says, it's my song. Constance Craving. <laughs> oh, my God. That's hilarious. <laughs> oh, so, well, that's really sweet. Oh, and John Bai's here. Hey, John Bai. Hey, John Bai. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Oh, Beth says her uh, dear mom's 84th birthday is tomorrow. Oh, we got some well, lo- lots of well wishes birthday, going around. Happy birthday, Alice. Pamela Jane Kennedy McGarrigal. Happy Canada Day. Her birthday is the 4th of July. Oh, my gosh. Well, there you go. So that's coming up. Drink wants a motorbike box for uh, for his bike. So, Whoa. But he also wants for everyone to be nice to each other. So I would really like for Drink to get both of those things. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Me too. Yeah. That so that's awesome. Oh, Debbie's watching. Hey, Debbie Kramer. Hello, hello. Laura is watching. Laura! Hey, Laura. Oh, my gosh. I miss you, Laura. Oh, and Jill Baycroft is watching. Hey, Jill. Wow. Yes. So, um, yeah, Craig and I, obviously, we decided that uh, this show would be CanCon. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, come on. It was the obvious choice. July 1st fell on a Wednesday. I know. So... Yeah, yep. more happy to do, and we and we do quite regularly feature feature CanCon here on the show, uh, and uh, you know we're gonna we're gonna keep doing it regularly. But tonight we're just we're just gonna make a big deal about it because yeah, it's, it's Canada, Canada Day. Day. So right. yeah, so if anybody out there, any, uh, sorry, go you go ahead. No, no, you go ahead. I was gonna say if anybody out there uh, wants to say uh, you know why they. Uh, love Canada. What's their favorite thing about Canada? If you're not Canadian, maybe there is something that you like about Canada too. Mm-hmm. Um, so this question's open to anybody out there watching. So uh, you know why? Why do you love Canada? Canada. <laughs> why do you love Canada Day? Canada Day. Yeah. So let us know. Mm-hmm. What were you going to say? I didn't mean to interrupt. Well, I was going to ask people what they've done today. If anyone has done anything, um, you know, fun for Canada Day, we put up this flag today. That's what we did. <laughs> yes. Mm-hmm. And yes, we had we a barbecue. Did. That yes. was nice. Yeah, we had a barbecue because I think that's what you have to do. Uh, you know, at least uh, that's, uh, I feel like that's my responsibility as yes. the one who normally eats all the food that uh, that you cook. Uh, and, uh, you know, <laughs> I need to at least do the cooking occasionally. <laughs> so Occasionally you do, yeah. which is really nice. Yep. So any excuse to, uh, to barbecue. Yes. Now, Steph said Lost Together just came on the radio. She said, did you ever tell that story? What story? I feel like I'm missing something. Steph, you may have to set her up for that one. Yeah. Um, probably not. Lost together. I mean, we have a few stories of us being lost together, but fill me in. Let me know what you are what you mean by that. I need to know. Oh, look at that. Linda says she is your new best friend. She comes and uh, visits Kitchener, which is not far away. No, Kitchener is oh like 10 minutes from here. Not, a, not at all. Not at all. Absolutely. Yeah, so Jarrett wants to know what... Uh, what Canada's Canada? Oh my gosh, I'm having a hard time saying Canada Day. Uh, so yes, yeah, the anniversary of uh, July first, uh, eighteen sixty-seven. So we're one fifty-three today. Yeah, hundred and fifty-three yeah. years. Yeah. So it's kind of like the, the the birth of of Canada. Uh, it certainly has uh, definitely changed. Uh, new ter- territories uh, have uh, joined since that day, but that's uh, Canada's birthday. Mm-hmm. So there you go. Yeah. Steph, I feel like I'm losing my mind. I don't know what you mean. The video we did just recently. Give me more than that. The, the Blue Rodeo oh, that Great video. Canadian Sing Along. Oh, the, the video, the major. I thought she meant like a Steph and I video <laughs> chatting because we do that a lot. Yes. Yes, Steph and I were part of the um, Blue Rodeo. That was back in May, I think. April, yeah. May. Yep, CBC Music did a great Canadian sing along, and uh, everyone voted and chose Lost Together as the song that yeah. the nation wanted to sing. That's right. So we recorded bits of it, and Steph and I got in the video. So if you, uh, and it's just great. I mean, it's great to see all these Canadians sing. It made me very misty eyed just seeing all these Canadians come together. And sing that song. Yeah, and That's if awesome. I was, if I had my uh, my act together, I would have put up a little video clip of it 
here tonight. Mm-hmm. Darn. Yeah. I do not have my act together. You win some, you lose some. But uh, yeah, if you just uh, if you just search for a uh, great Canadian sing along, mm-hmm. uh, it will pop up. Actually, if you look, uh, I believe somewhere within our our, our news feed, you'll find it there as well. So. Yeah. Yeah. So anybody anybody done anything exciting today? Yeah. Oh, Heidi. I went to mail stuff for my mom at Shoppers, and then I was reminded <laughs> that it's Canada Day. The post office was closed. Exciting. Right. Exciting. You almost and mailed Heidi something today. And Heidi got to see your mom today, which is so awesome. That is awesome. Oh, Heidi, I'm so happy for you. Yeah. She oh, video chatted me, and I cried a little bit. I was so excited for her. Yeah. Really. Yeah. Oh. I think one of Julia's favorite things is Canadian National Anthem, she said, which yeah. I thought you cleverly incorporated into Snowbird at the top of the show. So, bravo. Well oh, done. Oh, thanks. That thanks, was, thanks, thanks. That was awesome. Um. So, yeah, I'm trying to think back to some of my most favorite Canada days. I would say, like, definitely having some pool parties. They, that was pretty fun. Yeah. Um, and uh, Canada 125, I remember. Okay, she's about to go jump in the river. Okay, <laughs> no Steph, problem. go jump in a river. Yeah, go jump in a river. Go jump in a river. Have Steph. fun, Steph. I love you. Um, Let's see when you get back. So, uh, so yeah, we were, I was talking to Craig today on our walk. I'm like, don't you remember Canada 125? You don't really. Well, I mean, I do because I'm wearing my 125 no, t-shirt. 150 t-shirt. 150 shirt. Sorry, you're right. You asked me 125. Yes, yes. I don't remember much about anything beyond, obviously, <laughs> the past few years. That's all right. That's okay. So, oh my gosh, Geraint said he's given up smoking. Nice. Good for you. Well, I remember um, 125 being in St. John, New Brunswick, my friend Gordy, and I think Kelly Thorne was there, and Marcella, and um, Steph. And we just went downtown St. John, watched the fireworks, hung out. It was good. Yeah, I mean, I remember fireworks. It was a good time. Oh, look at that. Woody's uh, parents' retirement building opened up to oh two visitors. Gosh. So they're there watching the show oh with their gosh, parents. So it's fantastic. Hello. That makes me so happy for you. To the Woodburns. Wonderful, wonderful stuff. The Blue Rodeo concert. Hello. Hello. Oh, yeah. my gosh, that makes me laugh. Linda says, I love Canada because of your cool accent. Hmm. Educated people. We do have an accent. We do not bother other countries. <laughs> no, we don't. <laughs> Maybe with how polite we are or unapologetic we are. Yes. Well, I'm glad you love our accent. Yes. I don't, obviously we don't hear it. Yes, yeah, we don't hear it. But all the time uh, when I make phone calls, work-related phone calls to the U.S., the first thing they ask me is, are you in Canada? Really? I mean, I mean, I only call Canada now pretty much at, huh. my, at my current job, at my old job. I called the, the States quite frequently and they love to just ask, "Where, where's that accent from? You from Canada? Well, you know, it's funny. When I first moved out here, people are always asking me, you're not from here, like in Ontario. <laughs> I'm like, no, I'm not. So we'll have to play that clip of you oh on uh, Main gosh. Street. I had a bit of an accent. Let me tell you, bit, a little bit, a lot. <laughs> it's very funny, everyone. You don't it's realize it. Quite it's fantastic. You. It's you, right? Yep. Yeah. Oh, you just had a long H there. It's starting to come back. Right. 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 Throw my T away. <laughs> okay. So everyone, oh, I wish Steph was here to hear this song because I'm kind of doing this because I know she loves. <laughs> We're going to do a Jan Arden song, everybody. Never never done a Jan Arden song. No, uh, we talked about doing a Jan Arden night before. Uh, yeah, we that will happen. That will happen. Yeah. But yeah, this is quite literally the first time we've done a Jan Arden tune on the show, uh, I'm in- embarrassed to say, but we've, we've talked about it a lot. Yeah. We've talked about doing this song. And she's uh, hilarious. Oh my goodness. Yeah. She is so I funny. Like, I feel like we'd be good friends. Follow her on Instagram <laughs> immediately. Yeah. Oh, Steph, Steph is still here. Oh, good. Yeah. Oh, good, Steph. This song's for you. I hope you like it. Yes. So, uh, so here we go.
your heart it's a crime to fall in love again oh i probably won't remember me it's probably ancient history i'm the one the chosen few when i hold and fell for you i'm out of all the matter of touch i fell too fast i feel too much thought you might have some advice to give on how to be insensitive Well, there we go, everybody. <laughs> Steph's karaoke song, she says. Yes. So I assume, uh, therefore, you were uh, you were singing along, right, Steph? <laughs> While Levi was taking forever to eat his supper. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> it's true. He uh, he does take a while yes. to eat his din Yes. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. And uh, Chris says that uh, Jan Arden is such a great performer. She really is. Oh, she is. She's fantastic. She is. She's an entertainer. Yes, yeah, she's a Canadian treasure. Yep, yeah, she has got. <laughs> she's got it all. Yeah. Uh, but you know what's funny? <laughs> Sometimes I get tongue tied, as some of you might. I've been getting tongue tied in Canada all night. Um, <laughs> I get tongue tied, and when I, you know, even ten years ago, I'd hear people do that and be like, "This, what is wrong with them?" As you get older, though, people, <laughs> it happens. <laughs> it happens, and you know, I used to beat myself up over that stuff. Wine now, doesn't help, though. Huh? Wine doesn't. Well, I've only help. had a couple of sips. <laughs> I'm just um, so it's funny. I used to beat myself up. Now I'm like this. Uh, oh, what are you gonna do? <laughs> yep. It happened. Yep. It fell. What are you gonna do? Yep. This this is live. I can't get it right all the time. Well, or Jermaine, maybe half the time tonight. <laughs> Abba is great. I love Abba. They taught me how to sing. Absolutely. Honestly. However, can't wait they for our Abonite. Canadian. <laughs> yes, but when, yeah, we will definitely do an Abonite, and we're gonna have people here to sing with me. Yep, because we need harmony. We yeah, need I Abba. think there's a couple of people um, that have to be here. Yes, hmm, one of them's watching. Yes, we'll make that happen. Yep. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, Heidi says that that whole album is so great. That is true. Of course, now I'm forgetting the name of the album. Something in June. I forget it too. Terrible. We're, ter- we're terrible people. <laughs> so bad. Terrible people. Um, Steph was singing along, so that's well, good. Well, that's good. Definitely that's drink. Good. We will definitely do an Abba night. Oh, David Lum is watching. Aww. Hey, David. Hey, David. Betty Ann is watching. Hello, Betty Ann. Hey, Betty Ann. Trish uh, Good says you have a beautiful voice. Thank you, Trish. I agree. Thank you very much. I agree. And we got some uh, a story up here. What? Brenda says that uh, she remembers you and your sister acting in the dinner theater in St. John. Oh, my word. <laughs> Brenda who? Uh, Brenda uh, Kiernahan Brennan. Oh, my gosh. Hopefully I'm not getting your name completely wrong. So now, that, now that's an awesome memory. Well, Brenda, that that's a long time ago. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> well, thanks for joining us tonight. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> Jurate wants to know uh, if uh, your shared birthday night is going to be an ABBA night. Hmm. <laughs> I'm not guaranteeing that. <laughs> yes. We'll see what happens. O- we're not making any promises either on my... My and your birthday. Yeah. Uh, not sure noted. if I will be in the right frame of mind to do a show. <laughs> right. What do you mean by that, sweetie well, I'm pie? I'm celebrating. Yes. Yes. How so? Just, just having some fun. I see. Yes. Um, but I'm not saying we're not. We don't know. But the likelihood of us doing a show is is a little less than the likelihood of us doing a show. Yes. We'll be playing that one by ear. Living oh. Under June. Yep. That's Heidi, the name. Heidi right. Thank you, Heidi. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah. yeah. 
No rush. That's very sweet, Geraint. I guess we are kind of living under June now. Isn't June's it beautiful that Geraint is over there yeah. in Wales and he's just chatting with us? Love it. Oh, Brenda. Brenda knows my mom and dad well. Well, aren't you lucky, Brenda? Yes, they're, they're wonderful people. Wonderful people who are watching. So hi, Ernie and Jojo. Oh, thanks, Steph. Thank you, Ashley. <laughs> Thank yes. you, Ashley. You're amazing. Yep. Any more uh, compliments about Andrea's hair? Please let them let, let us know in chat. I will definitely <laughs> highlight those. Andrea loves <laughs> hearing about that. <laughs> okay. Now, what do you got coming up next? Too bad. Uh, too bad Charlie Reindris isn't here. It is too bad he's not here. He yeah. may watch. Yeah, so, he'll probably watch the replay. In which case, we'll talk about you now, Charlie. And there's nothing you can do to defend yourself. That's right. That's right. Charlie Reindris is a is a dear friend. He was on our show three week, two weeks ago. Was yep. our hundredth show episode one hundred? Yes. Thanks, mom. Um. So. But yeah, he wrote a biography of our a bi- next biography Canadian. Uh, that's right. And when I was telling talking to mom and dad yesterday. Dad's, I said, we're going to do an all-Canadian show. He goes, well, I hope you're doing Stompin' Tom. And I'm like, I am definitely going to do a Stompin' Tom song. So um, this song goes out to Dad and my sister. Now, the funny thing is, Dad always watched hockey when we were young. Mm -hmm. And um, when we were really young, like we used to, I remember going to bed and having to get up and asking him to turn the TV down because he'd get excited watching the game, right? I could hear him like doing this. Putting his hands together, he get very excited. <laughs> so, um, so he loves hockey, big time. And Steph and I were kind of like, eh. <laughs> but something happened to Steph, and now she's this massive hockey fan. Like she's a huge hockey fan. It she happens. Loves the Habs. It happens to people. Yeah, it happens to people. Yep. And I'll tell you this: last year, Steph and I. <laughs> We were in we were in Toronto visiting a friend of ours, Elizabeth Doherty. Like a, she's like a sister. She was in there having some some tests done, so we went in to see her. And um, we're sitting having supper, and Steph's like, "Oh my god, Anne! The uh, Air Canada Center is just like right over there." <laughs> That's right. And I'm like, "Uh huh." She's like, "There's a hockey game on," and I'm like, "Uh huh." She's like, "Want to go?" I'm like, "If you buy my ticket." <laughs> <laughs> Spoken and like a true did. non-hockey fan. She bought my ticket. We went to the game together. And, of course, it's mostly Toronto fans. Now, mm-hmm. there were some Montreal fans yeah. there. I mean, if I had to pick a team, of course it would be Montreal. Yeah. So, and you too. Um, right? Yeah. I mean, Montreal Absolutely. was my team growing up. There you go. In my so, um, so, I became a fan that night because Montreal won in overtime. And it was one of the best games. Steph and I were both up uh, off our seats holding each other. And we were sitting beside this bunch of guys <laughs> who were there for a, a stag party. And um, we got to know them. And we had so much fun. They actually, they actually asked Steph and I to go out with them. They're like, do you guys want to come out and party with us? I'm like, us? We're two old ladies. Really? <laughs> Anyway, we couldn't, but um, it was, we had so much fun. Yes. Um, Steph's not just a hockey game. It was Montreal and Toronto. Oh, I know. Mm-hmm. It was pretty incredible. Really, yep. really, really. You even watched it. She cried. Oh, yeah, of course, because I was looking to see if I could see you on the TV. Steph did cry. Yeah. Steph did cry. I think I, I might have teared up a little bit <laughs> when they won. It was pretty phenomenal. It was a great game. Yeah. So lots of drama. Anyway, you definitely got your money's worth, Steph. You got your, yes, <laughs> she got her money's worth treating me to that. So, Steph, when I'm back, working (laughs) um and things are open again i'm going to treat you to some theater tickets you and i are going to go see something together something good something good i can't wait (laughs) okay well everyone so here we are i'm sure you can all guess the stomp and tom connor's song i'm gonna do here we are everybody this song goes out to my dear sweet dad and my sister all right ready Oh. <laughs> Hello out there, we're on the air, it's hockey night tonight Tension grows, the whistle blows, and the puck goes down the ice The goalie jumps, the players bump, the fans all go insane Someone roars, Bobby scars at the good old hockey game Oh, the good old hockey game is the best game you can name 
too. Oof. Oh, take me where the hockey players face off down the rink, and the Stanley Cup is all filled up for the chance to win the drink. Now the final flick of a hockey stick and one gigantic scream. The puck is in. The home team wins the good old hockey game. Oh, the good old. Everybody, that goes out to Steph and my dear old dad. There you go. Yeah. Oh, a, I a, love that. That's a good song. That is. <laughs> While this is an inspired performance, <laughs> says uh, says Heidi. Yes, Heidi, <laughs> absolutely, big time. She was having a lot of fun. Let's with have that so one. much fun. <laughs> and that came on at the hockey game, and Steph and I lost our minds. We sang the whole thing. I actually have it on video. Anyway, there you go. <laughs> Steph says, "I love it." I imagine. Awesome. Yes. Oh, they love that song. <laughs> That's a good song. Okay. Well, there we go. Yep. That that was that was a lot of fun for me. <laughs> yes. Very so much. You're very welcome for that stuff. <laughs> yes. You're very, very, very welcome. Yeah. And uh, sounds like Woody heard me uh, tune in, chiming in with the last chorus. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Craig sang that. Everyone. I couldn't resist. Craig sang that. I'm assuming everyone else was singing along. So. I'm assuming, too. So, Geraint, that's uh, another piece of Canadiana there. It's that, almost uh, like the anthem. Yep. So, Stomp and Tom, uh, the hockey song. Yeah. <laughs> Let me tell you. Yeah. And Bud the Spud. And Bud it the was Spud. between those two, because my dad loves potatoes. And I spent a lot of time on PEI, and of course, being in your budget, close And to you PEI. love potatoes. I love potatoes. Everyone loves potatoes. Yep. Okay. Steph says she's jumping in the river now. So, go jump in the river, Steph. <laughs> we'll see you whenever. And Faith said that she had to introduce her American son-in-law to Stomp and Tom. Well, good for you. That is, uh, you are uh, doing... Good for you, Faith. Yeah, you're doing your, your good work. Your due diligence. Yeah. Uh, Steph, yeah, Steph, you really don't want to uh, go and supervise. You really, there's a couple c- coming up that you're going to be like this. Mm, I, I need to be there for that. Oh, Steph, you enjoy your Canada Day. Don't let your sister make you feel guilty for one hour hanging out with your one hour with, with your boy. I'm just joking, <laughs> mostly. Cute. I love you. Have fun. Yep. Um. So, oh my gosh, Emily, Emily, imagine. I miss you. I miss <laughs> you too, Emily. So, Julia, I did a little bit of the Canadian anthem. Yeah, if you were yes. here at the top of the show, you heard how she blended that with Snowbird. <laughs> that really impressed you. Well, yeah, you just kind of you just came up with that, like just spur of the moment. Well, it's not it's both the same key. It's not. Yeah. I know you, you. You had you had to make it work. <laughs> Look, I'm a drummer. Do you think I know much I about like that that the, you. the operation that of very, very uh, the musician's sweet. brain? I mean, I just keep rhythm. <laughs> Look at Steph. Seriously, crap. <laughs> <laughs> yes, well, Steph. Steffy. But we always have uh, entertainment worth uh, sticking around for here on the show. So yes, absolutely. <laughs> so. So everyone, um, this next song we're going to do is, um, is I have a hysterical story about this song, Craig. Go with the story and song. So here we are. So this, <laughs> I love you, Emily. So this song, Steph, you're going to want to hear this story. <laughs> so this song Steph, come back. is a song by Canadian band Glass Tiger. Yeah. Do y'all remember, do y'all remember Glass Tiger? So. I would have been, I don't know, in junior high when they got pretty big. And um, Marcella, my best friend and I, were down at Market Square on the boardwalk. (laughs) And we heard this band playing Don't Forget Me When I'm Gone. Mm -hmm. And we're both like this. They're not very good. (laughs) They don't sound like them. They're not very good at all. I'm like, are they lip syncing? Like, that's... No, they're they're not doing... No, things are out of (laughs) tune. It doesn't sound good. Here we are in grade seven. Anyway, heard on the radio on the way home. It was Glass Tiger. Oops. <laughs> that story makes me laugh so hard. Like two kids in grade seven. They don't sound very good. 
It was you glass sure it was tiger. glass tiger? It wasn't was... like, like, like grass liger or no, something like that? It was, like a, like a it, was, it was glass tiger. Yeah. yeah, it makes me laugh. It was kind of a rainy night. Maybe they weren't feeling it in St. John. <laughs> Chris anyway. says that glass tiger was the first show he ever saw in Cambridge, of all places. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> so what do you think of them, Chris? Yeah. Do you enjoy it? I'm sure they're great. But oh, yeah. That yeah memory, and they're still doing their thing. Craig, that memory just cracks me up, yeah, though. Two funny. kids in grade seven. Doesn't sound like them. Yep. And we did hear, I think it was Glass Tiger's drummer was playing. We were playing at like a Battle of the Bands up in Havelock, remember? I think it was the drummer for Glass Tiger. Who? Was playing with one of the bands that we were competing really? with. Really? Yeah, I remember he was really loud. Oh, that guy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I do remember him. Yeah. 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 Wow. That's kind of crazy. Yeah, that arena was hopping all of a sudden. Now, Chris, I'm thinking about you and your broken wrist. <laughs> or bro- is it an arm or a wrist? Do you I know? I think it's his wrist. Oh, Chris. Chris, are, is it your right hand or your left hand? And are you right-handed or left-handed? Look like his right hand. Please give us a diagnosis. Yes. Please in chat. Let me tell you, when I broke my wrist, I broke my it's right. It's going to take him a while, though. He's going to type it with I his know. left hand. I <laughs> know. I broke my right wrist in university, and um, I fell down a flight of stairs. Uh, a para went out, and they sang it acoustically. Pretty epic. Oh, very nice. good. That's great. Nice. That's really great. <laughs> my story kills me. <laughs> <laughs> so in university, I fell down a flight of stairs outside because there was like an overhang and I broke my wrist and I was playing piano in the pit for Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor oh, right. Dreamcoat. So I had to play the entire score with my left hand and kind of play like this with my right. <laughs> yep. Like just kind of do yep. like this. Just yeah. On the it was crazy. And I had to learn how to write with my left hand because, well, that was before computers in university. And um, it was in February, so it was right before midterms. Anyway, good times. Oh, at least Chris good says he's times. right-handed, and it was oh, his left wrist. Well, there so. you go. There you go. Phew. Little, little miracles to be grateful Phew. for, right? And Jereen says he broke his wrist when skateboarding. Uh-huh. Uh, luckily, I, I sucked at skateboarding and, and realized it, so I never uh, tried anything too dangerous, so I never actually injured myself skateboarding. You never broke a bone. No, no. I, I kind of knew I wasn't good at it, so I really no, didn't. No, no, but doing anything, that just surprises me. No, just a toe. Huh. As far as I know. Because Steph is... I, well, I whacked that like in a door frame down in my parents' basement when yeah. I was young. Yeah. Yeah. Steph has... Uh, she's very goofy, and she falls all the time, but she's never broken anything. Yep. She must be like uh, kind 80% of, rubber. Kind of amazes me. Yeah. <laughs> I've seen her tumble many times. <laughs> yes. Yeah. And Levi takes after Steph. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We that laugh. boy scares me. <laughs> oh, my God. So sweet. <laughs> okay. Well, here we are. So this is um, this is a Glass Tiger song. I hope you all enjoy it. And uh, here we go. Yeah, this is our take. So this is uh, our take on their song.
our take on a glass diver song. Yeah, yeah. it's kind of funny. Go. I know go. it's a little uh, a little slower than you're used to that that driving. Go do do ga da do 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 ga da do 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 da do. But we like it. Yes. <laughs> yes. So Drake wants to know if that's on Spotify. Oh yes, everything we're playing tonight. If you're watching us from abroad and you're new to Canadian music. Yeah, just uh, uh, I'll put the list up of all the tunes that we do uh, after the show. So just hit up the show notes and uh, look them up on Spotify and get your dose mm-hmm. of uh, Canadian content. Uh, Absolutely. Wherever you are. Um, Heidi says she had a, well, not a crush. She thought Alan Frew was cute. Well, there you go. Very cool, <laughs> Heidi. I mean, with that hair? Yes. Definitely. 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 Yep. Def- I just remember thinking when I was I wanted young hair like that. That I was so proud that they were Canadian because... You know, it seemed like there weren't a ton of pop artists in Canada. Many more in the States, right? Yep. I'm sure there were all kinds, but they weren't getting the radio play. So it was just kind of exciting to know that they were from Canada. Aw, thanks, Mom. I love you. There you go. Good song, you too. Music sounds great. Lots um, of so, Mama, my dear sweet Mama, this, uh, this next song, um, you heard me practice many, 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 many times growing up. Um. Yeah, I think we should just play it and see if anyone knows what it is. Oh, yes. Are, are we going to jump into our next song? Let's jump into it, baby. All right. We'll okay. jump, we'll Give jump me a right minute. I've got to like... So you don't, you don't want me to put it up on the screen? What? The song. I'll go for it, I guess. <laughs> I like surprising people. Oh, I think they'll be surprised that that, that you're doing it it's all the fun. same. All right, well, we're going to jump right into the next tune. <laughs> Loved holding on to that note that there. <laughs> You're having a little oh my god too much fun there. I think if I had had <laughs> if I had had this this keyboard back <laughs> when I was playing the piano, I would have lost my mind yep. to use all those sounds. <laughs> yep. So does anyone remember what that was? <laughs> yeah, I put it up on the screen. Oh, it was yeah the love theme from Saint Elmo. But who Fire. wrote it? David Foster. Oh, I wanted to ask the people out there. Oh, sorry. David Foster wrote that. Now you're spoiling that. it. <laughs> and um, one of my uh, most favorite movies growing up was, um, oh my God, the name just, remember I told you I forget things now? Um, it was- That's my job to forget things. Craig, what was the name of that movie that I love? Oh, my word. Um, starts with an S. Sh- uh, oh, my word. It's a, it, All the music was David Foster. Remember? It was a baseball movie. Oh. With, uh, with Jodie Foster. Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh! Now I'm losing it. Come on, come on, come on! Oh, I almost had it. 
Oh, I almost. This is cool. Is it this the is build it and they will come one? This is great for you guys to be watching oh, this right now. This makes for bad TV. Oh my god! I wish I could remember it though. Does anyone out there know the movie <laughs> I'm talking about? Judy Fo- Jody Foster, and um, it's a baseball stealing home. Stealing home. Stealing home. I'm so glad I thought of it. Hilarious. It wasn't the one I was thinking of. <laughs> no, but I no. loved the soundtrack from that movie. Yep. Loved it. Loved it. Oh, loved Brenda it. Brenda thought that your rendition was beautiful. Aw, thanks, Brenda. Uh, Emily loved how much you were. <laughs> How much fun you were having. Oh, I had so much Ado- fun. Ador- adorable. That. Yes. It was. We kind of threw that one in. It was uh, a fun little. Uh, fun it little was. Thing. I rem- Well, I, I, you know, did a little research and I thought, yeah. who can we, what kind of music do we want to play on Wednesday well, night? I mean, and I looked at all the top, you know, artists through the centuries. He's this a, century and he's last century. He's a famous Canadian composer. And yeah, his name was there. I'm like, oh my God, I'm going to play that song. So it's kind of fun. So there we go. And look at Isaac Ward is here. Hey, Hello, Isaac. Isaac. Well, mister, we are nearing the end of our show tonight. Yes, we are. Thank um, you for hanging out with stealing us. Stealing Home. See, Emily got it. She got it. She knew. Yeah, I loved that movie. Yeah. Loved it. So, again, once more, happy Canada Day. Happy Canada Day. To everybody out there watching. We are so blessed. We are. To live in Canada. Yeah. We have a, you know, a lot of things to improve upon. Definitely. Absolutely. But, you know, I am so grateful that i live in canada Mm -hmm. so grateful when i see you know how horrendous um some people's lives are uh south of us yeah that shouldn't be the case but people so close to us have it so different yeah yeah we're very blessed to be in canada and um yeah i'm really 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 grateful to be here um yeah so there you go so craig what's what's being a, a canadian what's that mean to you one of the things that I love about uh, being Canadian is uh, is the reputation that, that we have, you know, and it's it's true. I love that uh, whenever I go somewhere and I have a Canadian flag on, you know, on me or or on my, on my luggage, people always have nice things to say about Canada. It's it's a country to be extremely proud of. I mean, like you said, we still have a lot of work to do f- for sure. But, uh, you know, Canada is doing a lot of things right, uh, very, very diverse country and very welcoming. Uh, and, you know, uh, I, I just, I don't know, I just, I just love being Canadian. Yeah. I'm very proud. Yeah, me too. I, and I know that, I mean, that it's, I was born here, right? So it was not my, not my choice, but it, this is, I feel like this is a place that I'd want to be mm-hmm. if I was, you know. Somewhere else. Somewhere else. Yeah. So. Yeah, me too. Very proud to live here. Yeah. That's great. Uh, Linda says that she Beautiful. likes my soul kiss. Does that mean this little thing here? Is that, was, is, you, is that what you call it where you are? Soul kiss? Soul patch? I don't know. I've heard it call a, f- a few things. So. Yes. That's sweet. Yeah. Very now, sweet. Uh, Julia, I think she's uh, saying uh, Jan Arden. She said this comment a few times. Oh. Jan Arden is 58? There you and she go. wants poor Shania Twain. Uh, although Shania, yes, she's definitely a Canadian icon. We we did uh, we did one of her songs we did song one of her songs week. last week and I think the week before. Yes, we Because we know how much you love Shania, That's so those right. those tunes were for you, and we'll definitely do some more Shania Twain. That's right, absolutely, we will. Absolutely, absolutely. Drake wants to know if we're still on lockdown. Um, big time. Things are loosening up a little bit. Oh, we're, um, we're still. On. We're on definitely. Yep, yeah, we're in phase. You know, two. You know what I say? Just because everything's open doesn't mean you have to go you want to support people absolutely but find a way to to be out and clinging glasses this for me is not the time find a way to do it safely Mm -hmm. uh, to support your local businesses safely keep yourself safe keep your family safe yeah wear a mask yeah and keep those uh who are working at the establishments that you do visit at this time, yep. keep them safe. So we strongly encourage wearing a mask. Big time. Uh, whenever you go out in public. Big time. Um, so especially if you're going to be uh, indoors, absolutely. I, mean, mm-hmm. I will always be wearing a mask uh, until uh, until you know, things are dramatically different. When Probably a year and a half, I'm yeah, guessing. It'll be a while. Yeah. 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 So have fun with your mask. Get something fun. Yeah. Absolutely. Yep. All right. <sighs> Well, all right. So, shall we uh, shall we end the evening with us? I guess uh, an artist that everyone's I'm sure expecting us to play tonight. Yes, it's been a while. It's been a little while. It has been a little while. Yeah. We're going to end with a Jim Cuddy tune, everybody. Yeah. It's uh, it's quite possibly. Mm, I can't say it's my most favorite because I it's hard to choose one. Yeah. But this is up there. Yeah. 
and uh, we do love playing. We have, we've played it before. Yes, definitely. Um, it's off his not his latest album, the Countrywide Soul album before that, uh, which is Constellation. And uh, yeah, we we tried to get Jim to come on the show here for our hundredth. Uh, yep. He we'll must. Keep, he must been too busy. We'll keep trying. But we're gonna keep trying with the Jim hashtag. Jim, Jim be our guest, guest. and uh, you never know. We have the technology now to have Jim on the show virtually. He doesn't actually have to travel here to our living room studio. That's right. He can video in from the comfort of his studio and, that be nice? and join us. Absolutely. And uh, <laughs> blow our freaking minds. So. <laughs> Absolutely. So Jim, if you're watching, be our guest. Yes. If anyone's watching who knows Jim, yes. please tell Jim. Please tell him. Be please. Our guest. Please. Absolutely. <laughs> okay, everyone. Well, like I said, this is our last number for the night. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah. Hope you like it. Yeah. Happy Canada Day. Happy we'll Canada Day. We will we'll wish you all good night on the other side of this Jim Cuddy tune. Take it away. Up here, it's quiet in the mornings. Just whisper.
Well, there we go, and everyone. Happy Canada happy Day. Happy Canada Day, everybody. Happy Canada Day. <laughs> hope, hope, hope you had a wonderful day today celebrating in a in a different way, for sure. Yeah. Um, I think Craig and I will go upstairs, maybe sit outside and yeah. hope for some fireworks. Finish, yeah, finish this here drink. It's starting to get a little dusky out there, so mm-hmm. hopefully you guys haven't missed fireworks uh, where you're where you are out there. Uh, so thanks so much for tuning yeah, in. Thanks, uh, everybody. Aunt Jean says, great show, guys. Aw, well, thanks, thank Aunt you. Jean. Thank uh, you, Linda thank you, thank says, you. fantastic show. I look forward to Wednesday night with you guys. Excellent music, funny dialogue. I'm glad you think so. And uh, we look forward to it uh, as well. And Pamela says, beautiful voice. Aw. Yeah, and Faith thank says, you. another great show. Thanks, Andrew and Craig, for sharing your awesome talent. Thank you, everyone, for sharing your time. Yes, uh, thanks at- for being here. Your attention. That is the world's most precious resource right now. So we Absolutely. appreciate you spending your uh, your attention mm-hmm. for an hour hanging out with us. So, Absolutely. Uh, we really, really, really appreciate it. Thanks, so, Mom. Um, are we going to be doing a show? Oh, there's Heather. Hi, Heather. Going to be doing a show next week, do you think? Yeah, for sure. All right. So We'll be here July the 8th. Yes, we'll it's be here. It's also Julia's birthday. Yes, yo, that's right. So we'll be here for we'll Julia's birthday. We'll definitely be here. Absolutely. Maybe the week after. We might take the week off for uh, for your birthday, my sweet Aww, one. Thanks, Jareen. Aw, thanks, Craig. Thank you. Okay, everyone. We'll have a wonderful week and be kind to each other. And um, we'll see you next Wednesday. Happy Canada Day. Happy Canada Day. Bye, everybody. Bye.